visit eaglerunnerbill.com. It's Eagle Runner Bill here. This is my shiitake mushroom garden. I inoculated them logs probably six, seven years ago, and I've had good production of mushrooms. And now, right now, they're not producing very well. The logs are falling apart. I, have, I think all the material growth out of them old logs is gone. So I'm going to inoculate some more logs with these chicken of the woods mushroom spawns. And I'm putting them in smaller pieces of wood. What I'm going to do is take my drill bit, put a piece of tape on it, so I know how deep to drill the holes for that plugs. And here's my logs. I've soaked them in water for like 48 hours. So I want them as full of moisture as they possibly can be so the mushrooms will thrive in it and not dry out. Now on these mushrooms it says plug the log like every two inches and you want to just fill the log with holes and evenly space all your plugs. So I'm sitting there drilling my holes and also with the smaller log I should get mushrooms quicker but also the log will die quicker. I'm not going to get six years of life out of this small log. But as long as I have more mushroom production and with the small logs I could put, it, put them in the refrigerator for, for a day or two and then when it comes out that'll make the mushroom the log produce more mushrooms. Here's my spot, my plugs and now you want to put your plugs in the holes you drilled make sure they're down below the surface of the bark and then I'm going to cover each one with a coating of wax because I want the wax to seal the spore so number one it stays moist and number two I don't have any bugs get inside there and contaminate the spore and kill it so you want to cover them good with a nice coat of wax so they don't dry out and bugs don't contaminate your mushroom spore and kill them. So with these smaller logs, they're not going to live as long as my other ones did, but hopefully I'm going to be able to get them to produce more mushrooms. And I'm just storing them in a shady, damp place, and I'll water them like the instructions tell you to. And hopefully I'm going to do good with these guys. Hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.